wrestling and you. Uh, usually I'm a little more happy and just outgoing, but as you can see, I'm by myself. <clears throat> Casey Strata, since becoming the world's, the people's, whatever the hell he is, rubbing the title, cha the champion, he's the champion. He just, he's become a different man, and uh, like the guy doesn't even answer my phone calls, my emails. He hired a personal assistant, folks. I have to call a number to some woman that I've never met to get a hold of the guy. And now he's wrote me via email. Well, I should say his assistant has wrote me via email. And now, brought to you by Checkers, your world heavyweight replica champion, Casey Strata. If you're in the game, well, then the stroke's the word. Don't take no rhythm, don't take no style. Dude, what's up? With, what's up with the glasses, dude? Like seriously, it's. Who are you? Are you are you ready? When your star <laughs> shines this bright, the UV protection is needed. <laughs> Are you ready t to start the show? Are you going to open the show now? Or what's going on here, dude? What do you think? So so you're not even going to have the decency to introduce yourself to me. You're just going to ask me if I'm going to open, this, open the show. What is your name? Dude, you it doesn't matter you what your name is! <laughs> uh, 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 don't even! Don't even! Because I know who you are. I know, Strata knows who you are. You're, you're the host of the most interactive pro wrestling talk show on the face of the interweb, right? It's true. Yep. You, you, you interview people, you review games, wrestling pay-per-views, uh, DVDs, uh, weekly television shows. You do it all. Yeah, pro wrestling. Of course I know who you are. You're Jabroni Grut. You got the little jabroni that comes in, ruins all our shots. I know who you are. You're lucky I don't give you a replica rock bottom right right now. Uh, uh, you know, this is fucking ridiculous, okay? Let me explain something to you. I'm no jabroni, okay? Listen here, you turd nugget, with your little glasses and your fox t-shirt and your stupid little replica belt and your horrible 80s comb hair back like your fucking Don Knotts. Explain something to you. You're not the Rock. Don Johnson. Don, Fair enough. D no, Don Knotts. Oh man, the Three's no Company. Three's Company. <laughs> it just worked when I said it. it flowed well when I was going. Okay, don't throw my shit off. Okay. God damn. Get, your girlfriend buys your replica belt. Soon you're hot shit, huh? Is that how it works? But, uh, I won this fair and square. Yeah, you won it from what? From a from some other seller on eBay, maybe. The sell. Wrestling lover eight eight five seven, we won it fair and square. Fair and square. You know what? Just wait. I got something in the works for you. Something down the line. Yeah. Something yeah. big. Well, I'm gonna take a phone call. I'll be back. Yeah, Mr. Big Shot. Yeah. Walk all slow in front of the camera like you're hot shit. You see what I mean? You see this crap, folks? This is what I gotta deal with on a weekly basis. This is crap. Call me a fucking gun, don't you me? What's up, Chief? Why are you starting the show without me? Dude, seriously? What? Really? What? Whoa, what yeah. was that all about? Yeah, that's up Why in you your mean? face. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, Grut, whoa. <sighs> Why is he so irritated? Son of a fucking bitch. Jesus. Let's just start the damn show. Alright, that's fair enough, I guess. Anyway, so you wanted me to talk about what was happening to me lately, right? With who? With me. What's been going on with yeah, me? What's, what's, what's going on with you? Well, well, he, Joey wanted me to talk about. I tried to to purchase something online. You know when <clears throat> when I, I always give you the everyone our weekly updates on new wrestling merchandise you've been purchasing. And before I get into the story right now, if you are a Ken Kennedy fan, not only does Ken Kennedy have a brand new T-shirt out, which I'll be purchasing. War of the words. You can purchase that right now. Very stylish shirt. If you go on WWE auction. You're gonna find a a, a a a black and white photo still autographed by Ken Kennedy. There's gonna be a run of only 12. They've already sold the first, so jump on the second. It's coming up real soon. You might be able to get the subsequent ones. 
And uh, that'll be a big collector's item for the Ken Kennedy uh, fan base. Anyways, so I, I wanted to buy the Christopher Daniels DVD, which is now sold out, so obviously I never got the chance to buy it on Shop TNA. And um, <clears throat> it was $6.47. And uh, so I, I wanted to buy it. It was real cheap. Don West told me I could do it. It was a deal today, so I purchased it. Click on it. Was it Jim Mint 10? It was Jim Mint 10, and it came from Beanie Baby. Of uh, Christopher Daniels. Probably the Princess Diana Beanie Baby. Those yes. Those like hotcakes. They do. <laughs> He's a fan of the opera one, too. <laughs> Anyways, so, like, I go to buy it, and my shipping is $16. $16.60, actually. Uh, I'm thinking... I want to note that somebody's already talked about this, but I, I want Casey to tell the story anyways, because it's amazing. <clears throat> So I'm thinking, like, this this can't be real. It's it's a DVD. There's no way you can charge me $16 to ship a DVD. So being very upset because I wanted to buy this DVD so badly, I logged on, I sent them an email, and it, and it said something to the effect of... an electronic message? An electronic message, of course. To uh, I, Actually, I suggest all of you go and check this out because it's not just me. My girlfriend did it, too. You go... I sent them an email, and I said... I'm very upset, and this is outrageous that you would you would ask for sixteen dollars in shipping for was one DVD, and the only way I I, I mean I, I told him that I had purchased a, a Christian Cage T-shirt, which I think I've worn on the show before. Christian Cage T-shirt from them, and I had a great experience. I think shipping was like five bucks, which is okay. The shirt was like twenty twenty some anyways, and I told him the only way I was going to pay sixteen dollars if they had, if Christopher Daniels delivered it to my house himself. I sent that some bitch. Two days later, I get a reply. One sentence. Our shipping prices would be less outrageous and upsetting if you use the home delivery setting instead of the business. Just think about that for one moment. Well, that, that just Not that only just... was that a mocking statement to me when I was upset about this, it was really rude. And... When I went back, I said, okay, well, maybe, you know, besides them being a douche, maybe they're right. Maybe they're right. Maybe I just had the wrong sex. Maybe I sense. accidentally clicked the sex. Yeah, this could happen because I'm, I'm a jamook. So, like, I go on there, but my settings are still saved from when I bought the Christian Cage shirt, and it was still set on home delivery. But now, two days later, the shipping's $13, Joe. <clears throat> well... Unfortunately, I have no answer, and I can't help you with your shipping problem for TNA, yeah. which I have never bought anything off TNA. First, because they don't make shirts for fat people. Second, the Rhino sweater, the only thing I really wanted is like $80, and they never fucking have it. Yeah. Uh, but there is something new you can buy on TNA.com, shop, shop TNA.com. Yeah. What they like to call beating greetings. I thought this was going to be kind of risque just from the name. Well, let me explain what this is, and you can catch us on YouTube. Uh, TNA Wrestling, for a grand price of $44.95 of your hard-earned money, mm -hmm. you send it to TNA. This is a price of a pay-per-view plus 15 bucks. Yeah. You can get either Booker T, mm -hmm. which I guess is okay, Booker T, Jay Lethal, Eric Young, Karen Angle, and the ODB, and they will wish whoever you want a happy birthday, or if you just want them talking smack about you... And they'll still tape it, and then they'll send it to you. Yep. Okay. <laughs> but here's what we offer you instead. What Pro Wrestling U offers you instead. I hear I do a pretty good rock impression. I don't know if that's true or not. but uh, It's pretty spot on. But uh, I think that um, you should send us, if you're interested in a beating greeting, $5. And we will impersonate a wrestler for you of your choice and do the message that you choose. So I can do Booker T. Five time, five time. Oh, wait, I can't say that in WCW. <laughs> so, you could do anything like that. You could do anything like that. Grut could do the big boss man or something. Anything, we can do anything like that. So, it's up to you. America.